Hey Eagles fans, this is number 20, Kyle Huckabee. I'm a left-handed pitcher from Chandler, Arizona. The season is 20 days away, so in honor of that, here's a little bit more about me. Uh, I chose number 20 mainly because it was uh, my dad's number when he played, so I thought it was a good reason to take it. Uh, I decided to come to EMU to play baseball because it was a really good opportunity to play as a freshman and play Division I baseball. So um, I root for the Toronto Blue Jays because my dad's a coach for them, so it kind of just runs in the family. Uh, my favorite Major League Baseball player is definitely Marcus Stroman. Um, he's probably the only guy in the Major Leagues that's uh, shorter than me, and um, he just pitches with a lot of passion and stuff, and that's kind of something that I try to implement in my game. So, My biggest baseball idol is probably Jamie Moyer, because the guy pitched in the big leagues for like 30 years, and he threw like 81, and that's kind of sick. So. My favorite sport besides baseball is 100% football. Uh, I played in high school and I love the Philadelphia Eagles like more than life. So football is definitely my favorite sport. My walkout song is probably going to be Rambo by Bryson Tiller. If you don't know it, you got to come out and check it out in person. Uh, my favorite movie is probably Anchorman. My favorite TV show is probably It's Always Sunny in Philadelphia. My nickname is Huck. Come short for Huckabee, it's just kind of given. I never really like chose it to be my nickname, but just kind of stuck, so I roll with it. If I could live anywhere in the world, probably be on a beach somewhere, maybe like San Diego or something. Uh, I was there for like a couple summers in high school and it was like the best time of my life, so probably say San Diego. The funniest teammate on our team is probably Tony DeLeo, but not because anything he does is like he's not trying to be funny he just doesn't really have a grasp on like like the basic English language or like anyone who's ever like lived ever and he doesn't really know anything and it's kind of funny to make fun of him so he's probably the, definitely the funniest the biggest prankster or clown I'd probably say Brent Matson because he's always coming up with these like awful puns that like aren't funny initially, but then like five minutes later, you kind of like chuckle at him and go, okay, that was kind of funny. And he just keeps hammering him home and he will not stop until you start laughing. And it can get kind of annoying sometimes, but I would probably go Brent Matson, biggest clown. Best overall athlete is probably Sam Delaplane. Um, we, all, we used to play football last winter and, and the dude's just like a nightmare on the field. He can fly, he can catch, he can throw. It's, it's kind of scary and I don't know. I mean, there's some other ones, but I'd have to go Sam Delplane. The best dressed, there's been a big controversy between Luke Devaney and Brennan Williams, and uh, they're both like really good friends of mine, so I'm going to choose to have a no comment on that. Worst dressed, I'm going to have to go Tony DeLeo again. I mean, solely because he always looks homeless, and he wears like the same gray hoodie and gray sweatpants every day, so I'm going to have to go Tony DeLeo. Uh, the biggest goal for the rest of my collegiate career is, like I mean, everyone says, just win, win a MAC championship, and like instill winning, a winning tradition in Eastern again. If you want to see some depressing tweets about the Philadelphia Eagles, that's pretty much all I tweet about. You can follow me at Huckabee with two Y's and a nine. There's a little bit about me, Kyle Huckabee. Uh, I hope to see you all at O-Strike this season, and go Eagles.